What's his face is here? Peyton. That weirdo. He is there. I swear, if he messes with Megan again, I swear, I am going to burn him. Hi guys, my name is Rickton and welcome back to another episode of Sims 2 One Million Smolian Challenge featuring the Curious Brothers, Megan, Wilson and little Taicho... Whoa, he's not that little anymore! <laughs> Taicho Curious! So, um... The last episode... Um... Forgive me for, for forgetting because... I had my week away and I got busy again. So... Most of my memory of what happened previously has totally gone, so forgive me on that. We're just going to jump in and um, continue what we normally do in the series. We try and earn our way up to one million simoleons. And, um, oh, I've also got something else to talk about as well in a, in a bit, so I'll get around to that. I'll build up to it. And um, so let's start off with how much money we've got in the bank already. We have, if I can see the screen, uh, 74,638 simoleons, which is not too bad. Um, we need uh, 84,000, 94,000, and then we need 30 more, 30,000 more before we reach, reach, before we reach to our 1% of our goal. And then we started all over again. <laughs> uh, Megan, looking at her age, we've still got a few more days before we can plan our university series. Yes, I keep talking about that <laughs> because I am excited about it. Because going to the uni going to university in The Sims 2 is freaking epic. Because you get all this intuition money, and then you can buy all this nonsense. You buy drum set and all that crap, and you can put it in your inventory, and then bring it back home, and then you sell it, and then you get money, which is pretty cool. Hopefully, I remember to do that. I probably, will. I'll probably remember to sell all the stuff. We'll stay in the dorm though. We'll stay in the dorm so we don't spend too much money. We buy crap, and then we put it in our inventory, and then we come back, and we sell all the crap, and then we have more money. My plan. <laughs> and then we'll do it all over again with Wilson. And then we'll continue as normal. And uh, probably, you know, adopt a kid. And then for Wilson, we'll do the same because we're going to keep carrying on. And then those kids are going to be adopted. And then we'll get more aliens and crap. And then. <laughs> and then. <laughs> then we'll have. Um, Taicho, he'll do his university stuff at some point, and we'll do the same for that, and then we'll continue again. And I don't know how much we'll, how much money we'll have by then, but we'll, it'll be enough. Probably not enough. I don't know. Um, what's his face is here? Peyton. That weirdo. He is there. I swear, if he messes with Megan again, I swear I am going to burn him. <laughs> yeah, seriously. You have no idea how infuriating this Peyton guy is. If you remember a couple of episodes ago, he came in, he had the decency to come in and start a fight with Megan. In front of the sick! And I'm like, why do you keep coming in and causing mayhem? I swear if he broke that laptop computer. I swear if he broke that computer, has he broken it? Was it broken before? I don't trust him. He's very suspicious, him that yellow hat of his. I don't trust him. He's gonna do something mysterious. Oh, have the food. Well, have food. He's there watching TV. Sneaky. Sneaky, sneaky. I don't trust him. He is the antagonist of this series. I hate him. <laughs> Who's a protagonist? Well, the main three protagonists are the Curious Brothers, aren't they? Because, you know, you all came here to either... Watch the Curious Brothers and whatever the crap they do. Or, because this is the One Million Smellian Challenge, and you like that sort of challenge. <laughs> or it's The Sims 2 and you thought, hey, what the hell, it's The Sims 2, who cares? Either way, I want to thank you all for joining me. Because <laughs> I like all those. 
Hopefully that adopted kid can be related, because that would be great, that would be swell. Yeah, that's the- yeah, remember I talked about being only one alien in this world? That's him! That's him right there! So I don't know if he's going to affect other kids in the future. I don't know. We'll have to wait and see when that time comes, because... <laughs> I don't know, because wouldn't he be still to be the grandfather? He would be, wouldn't he? Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> Tedious. Then we still... Yeah, um... I don't know, maybe we could adopt an alien, maybe. I don't know how this is gonna go out. <laughs> I don't know how this is all going to go out, because... Freaking messing my head up. <laughs> so do one thing and we do another thing. And I don't want to have too many sims in one household because it's um gonna build up too much and uh, I don't want to play with multiple houses because of that. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see. Our main focus will be on Megan and her university goal in a couple of days' time. So we'll get to those adoptive or alien babies in the future after that. <laughs> Cause I always keep getting ahead of myself with this with this series because I want to do so much. She, oh she's gonna use a telescope um, telescope. Cause I wanna do so much but then there's so little I can do within that short period of time. Oh. <laughs> oh I hope I can do open broadcast. Um with this series, I hope I can do with that because it, it's like, that'd be great because we hear great hearing um, the voices too. But since I've got one more video to um, sort out, then um, I don't have that much time. So I got, I, I literally got two weeks before I can record that video again. Because you know, I have a two week rotation to do my videos. And I don't know if that's going to be enough time for me to find a free day to meddle with. The video, the the open broadcast stuff software. Studio. <laughs> um. I know we'll see about that. We'll see. I'll find. I'll try and find a day. And also, when I find when I have a free day, I want to play with the new uh, Yandere simulator update. Yeah, it's a new update came on the first. Also, be you. He's, he's he's doing something. He need. Oh, he needs to tinkle and he needs to go to bed. I'll send you to the bed in a bit. Send you to the bed in a bit. Do 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 do. Yeah. Looking outside. It's not snowing. It's not Christmas. It's autumn. It's autumn, yeah. But it's not Christmas. Peyton is still there. He's still there. Oh, it's raining though. Oh. Oh. Let's go outside in your underwear, because that is the most intelligent thing to do, and you won't catch the death. <laughs> oh, Laszlo. Oh, you're going to be an elder soon. But age doesn't matter, he's still going to be absolutely fabulous and crazy. Uh, I wonder who is going to be the Laszlo within Megan, Wilson and Tide Show. <laughs> I wonder who it is going to be. Um, cause, cause, since personalities can change, and um, uh, Megan, she's more of um, a, 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 pro a protective type. Cause every time we see Peyton, she wants to beat the living daylight out of him. And um, Wilson, he hmm. He seems to be more the uh, intelligent type, so he's doing a lot of studying and things like that. Um, as for Taicho, I'm not too sure yet. Not too sure. It's not till um, they become teenagers you get to see more of their personality a bit more better. So we'll see. You know, Taicho can be anything when he gets older. Or Megan and Wilson, they could be anything as soon as they reach adults. I mean, personalities change as you get older, but you don't know. You don't know how it's going to go. <laughs> it could go one way or another. <laughs> they, they could be absolutely annoying or absolutely fabulous or just in the middle. 
you don't know what's going to happen with them. But nonetheless, we are going to have fun with them in the future. And they are going to continue the crazy adventures that um, we, have, we are having currently. And then, of course, with the adopted kids as well in the future. Again, I am going too far for myself right now. <laughs> university first. University first. <clears throat> Studying how things naturally work right down to the very elements of, of our being is essential to leading a fulfilling life. Your growing enthusiasm for science, Megan, amplifies this. Yeah, because she needs a science because science! She's a curious. She's an alien as well. It's important with the sciences. Is, is, is. Yes, because that's what the curious family is all about. It's about aliens and the sciences. <laughs> oh. I, I, I love, I love this household. I really have no idea. I really do love it. And I was going to talk about something, wasn't I? Just checking the time. I've been going on for almost 11 minutes, so. Just keeping on top of things. I don't want to, you know, babble on too much about one thing at a certain time. So, um, okay. I, I, I made an application to, um, ah, oh, pardon me if I forget the name. Um, the name of this website is The Sims Legacies. And, um, oh, spot me on. Um, uh, that was over there. I would have gone to, would have gone and checked. Um, uh, you're right. <laughs> so, um, Sims Legacies. Ooh, a doggy. Ooh, a mysterious doggy. I wonder what this doggy is doing. Watch that doggy while I talk about this Legacies. Um, oh, I wonder what's the doggy. He's going upstairs. What's the doggy doing? What you doing, doggy? What you doing? What's going up here for you, doggy? Hey, you stopped up there. What's up, doggy? Had enough? You went downstairs now, okay. Ah. <laughs> uh, I wanna watch this dog now. I love that dog. Dogs are funny. <laughs> right. Dog's going down there now. It's always a good idea to go up two flights of stairs and went back down again. What were you expecting to find up there? A box of dog treats or something? You're going off again now. Who are you doing, you dog? <laughs> May. The dog's name is May, so it's a lady doggy. Alright, um. So, I, um. Send an application to The Sims Legacies. Um. I know two people who, um, own website um, uh, kit only human or more shortly known as kit and um, oh I know her oh I know her um, do you have discord up right now I don't pantalones um, bear with me uh, Oh, it's already loaded. That's quite fancy. Uh, da, da, da. I know her. 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 Ah, Krista. Krista. So it's Kit and Krista, and um, there's someone else there as well. I've not spoken to them, but it's definitely Kit and Krista who um, are the main owners of the site. And um, I sent my application a few weeks ago. Uh, what I have to do is, in that, do is, um, I applied the video there, and um, wrote a little bit what it's all about. There's a few boxes to. Um, I've got helicopters now. I don't know why. A few boxes to check out. Uh, write, write what it's all about, basically, and um, they will write their first impressions of it as well. Which is quite a nice impression. It was quite nice as well. Um, <laughs> it was really, really nice. Um, I definitely recommend you go and read what they wrote. I don't know who wrote it. I got a feeling... I don't know. I don't know. It could be, could be either one. It could be someone I don't know. Um, 
That would have been cool if it was someone I didn't know. <laughs> because if you're friends with someone, they always have that little tiddly bit to be nice. I don't know. So, I don't know. I, cause I, cause I am guilty about doing that. Because when I try and do constructive criticisms, <laughs> I always um, tend to put the criticism first then sparkle it up with something nice then more criticism and sparkle it up and then leave it with a compliment what I saw was just a giant compliment so I don't know I mean isn't uh, I, 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 I nothing against it it's quite really nice it made me feel nice and warm and fuzzy inside <laughs> but um that's all that, 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 that is my perspective of, of, of friends and people who don't know you because people who don't know you have no idea what you are, who you are, what you do, so they have like a blank slate to do. But if you're friends with this person who is reviewing it, they have the tendency to make it a bit more sparkly, if that makes sense. <laughs> I don't know, it's just probably they know you, you're a nice person, and they want to say something nice as well. It's just that. Thing we don't uh, take much uh, notice of, if that makes sense. Um, not that it's a bad thing, at least you're getting the main um, details out there. I know it's, it's, it's rather interesting, it's rather, rather interesting, I think. Um, oh, my face is flat, aren't they? Final comment I had right there. Ooh, their faces are rather flat, aren't they? I never really noticed that before. Not that it's a big deal or anything, I just thought, hmm. I'm usually familiar with like noses poking out, but I just saw how flat their faces were. But yeah, Vidcon's nose is going out, point out that way. But Megan's is more like, oop. Yeah. Yes, I have noticed that Alien's faces were a bit different than other Sims. But I didn't know it was going to be that flat. Of course, there's a little like a little stubble right there, but yeah. <laughs> anyway, and were um, <clears throat> wasn't uh, Vikund or someone else digging up things? Yeah, he's digging up right now. We got something in the the inventory. We've got something somewhere. Ooh, gamer guys here. Out of the bookcase and into the frying pan, Taicho's earned a cooking soap. Wait, what? Wait, Taicho can read cooking books? He's reading a cooking book! I thought kids can't understand cooking books. Oh, what the? I didn't know this. This is new to me. Ooh, he's got a map, thank you. I didn't know this. Because. In a Sims 3, when you, try and you, when you tell a kid to read a cooking book, they don't understand it. But look, Taisho, he's reading a cooking book! He's like, I know this, I know this junk right here. It's my jam. He's just like reading it like nothing on earth. Oh, <laughs> that was a punch, Megan. Jeez, calm yourself. <laughs> oh my word, dear, oh dear, Megan. Whack a boof! Uh, yeah, you sucker punched your brother! <laughs> I don't know what he's done to deserve that, jeez. Um, oh, he's found another tattered map. Mm. Ah, can we put all the maps together and make it look a giant treasure map? Oh, that'd be cool though. Oh, that'd be awesome. <laughs> ah, that'd be great. Yeah, you should go to school, young man. Stop reading about how to cook with Gordon Ramsay and go to school. Because, you know, you can read more about Gordon Ramsay when you get back home. You know, he's not going anywhere. He's got his kitchen and he's yelling at people. And he's got, like, his 50,000 books. You can read that once you get back home. Read Hel in what and watch Hell's Kitchen. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Gordon Ramsay, he's a riot. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. We made a mess. Yeah, let's freak out and panic in front of the water pipe. Yeah, that's gonna help crap out, isn't it? <laughs> right, 
Fast Tail is having a bath. We'll sort that hole out in a bit. We'll sort it out. Check the time. Check. Oh, I got. A oh, battery's dying. So, boop. Let's change the battery. Right, here I am. I'm back right now, and the time. Uh, we just almost got 20 minutes, so we have like 10 more minutes before the end of the video. Mm, time does fly on this series, doesn't it? <laughs> this day doesn't feel like. Doesn't feel too long. Yeah. Um. Well, I can't believe I talked about two subjects for ten minutes. That's insane. <laughs> I don't know how I do that though. I talk about one subject and then another one. What can I fill up for the last ten minutes? Um. Hmm. What can I fill up for the last ten minutes? I'm not too sure. Um. Let me think. Uh. Well, what I can say is you can go to um. I can't remember the website of the, the Sims Legacies website though. Um, if I do remember, I will put a link in the description. If I don't, then give me a yell and I will definitely put it in there. <laughs> um, but I totally recommend you going over there to um, to um, browse on uh, other stories that other Sims have made, other videos they have made. They're pretty awesome actually, they're all pretty great. Um, I'm contemplating on putting a university series, sending it to theirs, to the site, but I don't know. I don't know. So there's no real proper story about it, it's just like a sub-story of um, uh, what I'm doing in a 1 million smiling challenge, because um, that series can end abruptly. <laughs> and then um, we'll go back to the 1 million smiling challenge. Uh, someone special got some wine. He, uh, he loses some enthusiasm. Okay, so I guess his co worker didn't really like wine, Nectar. Hmm. Bit unfortunate. Because, you know, wine is alright to send to someone. Because you can put it down somewhere and it won't go bad. <laughs> Because what? Because you know, wine gets better with age. I don't really know. I don't know that. No, I don't know if I ever tried old wine yet. Really old wine. Is that theory true? I don't know. Because I always thought if something gets a bit too old, it gets a bit, you know, not very flavorful. I don't know. Wine is strange. It is really, really strange. Because with most things, if something gets too old, it gets bad. <laughs> um, yeah, but yeah, anyway, anyway. The, um, the, 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 the co-worker could, you know, just accept the wine and just leave it for so long and then come back to it when they're ready and then have it. It could be years or they could just give it to someone else. I don't know. <laughs> Wine is very simple to ha hand out to someone. Though I, though I think the older the wine, the more expensive it is. So, I don't know, that's probably why I have not noticed any difference <laughs> or tried it. Because. <laughs> why drink something so old? And why drink something so expensive? Because, you know. As soon as you drink it, it's gonna come out one end anyway. And it's not gonna be wine anymore. So, basically, you drank something, you, you drank your money away. Yeah. It could be a metaphor for something, I don't know. Uh, so, I'm, so, I'm being, you know, cautious and skeptical about buying expensive wines or. Buying wines that are all because why do you want to buy something that's you know probably seen the world longer than you? <laughs> I mean, I don't know. Don't take my word for it. There's probably wines out there that's a hundred years old. I mean, one of course it may be all right. 
to why <laughs> why because if that wine is older than you then I don't know it's a bit weird because then um, you have to preserve old things because it's historical because someone probably a hundred someone a hundred years ago made that wine it's been stored for that long and then you want to drink it it's like it's just that mentality of thinking, why? It's old, you meant to, you know, look at it and stuff. And probably save it a little bit, bit, bit more longer. And then see what the future says about it. You know what I mean? So just get a regular wine. <laughs> that's, what, that's, what, that's what I prefer to do. For five more minutes. No, I might as well just talk about, you know, old wine. <laughs> so I've been talking about it for the last five minutes. <laughs> Thank you, Laszlo, for giving me a topic idea to talk about. I didn't take her to work today. I cannot remember if they do go to work. Mm. <laughs> it's a bitsy city. Ooh, it sounds in vases. Interesting. <laughs> I need to remember to charge up both cameras at the end of my recording session. We've got two bars left on this. So this has got a stronger battery on it. So I should be fine. And I've got um, a few more videos to record after this as well. You know, it's all, you know, it was all pinned to get-go. <laughs> and today I do not have any Italian class today, so I've got a bit more time to spend on doing these and edited in them because um i edit these videos and then i keep them on, keep them on my external and then i go to my windows 10 laptop and let them export from there because they do it so much quickly <laughs> so um no, that's my initial plan to do things now um they do it so much more quickly yeah of course, it still takes time, but a hell of a lot more quicker. But I hiccup the whole time now. So, I can just, um... Uh, leave the video to export. Go out, do something else. Or, uh, do my work, let it export like that. And do it like that, yeah. I'll probably do that tomorrow. Yeah. I don't know what I'm going to do tomorrow, though. <laughs> I know I'm going to, um... Uh, go back and design the bag that I was planning on designing because I picked up a bag I thought I could have a choice of buying just one bag but oh, he's got paint on his chest um God, <laughs> um the bag that I looked at at um a limitation of up to only 50 bags so I kind of wasted time designing what I wanted on a nice bag so I had to like save what I wrote and so uh, probably tomorrow I'll go back to it pick up a bag that doesn't have a limitation and put and write down all the details and put it on there and yeah Peyton's back that's great that's great <laughs> Peyton is back so I had an indication that your grades were going up well. Is he off to show him? No? He's putting his homework on the floor, okay. So, um... Drop your homework in there. Okay. Um... You... Play some toys. I'll just check the time so we don't go on blabbing much. Okay. Got practically a minute now. Got practically a minute. Ooh, I gotta wrap things up now. <laughs> uh, I can't remember what I was talking about though. I can't remember. I know I was talking about wine. I know I was talking about fine wine, but. Uh, something else. I literally forgot what I was just talking about right there and now. Oh. <laughs> uh, 
Oh yeah, Echo Hall thing, yeah. Um, so yeah, I can get that all done tomorrow, actually. The rest of the video is done, because I don't have uh, an Italian lesson update to update on, because I've got no class. So I can get those probably all done by tomorrow. That'd be nice. Yeah, the video's done and edited today, and get them exported tomorrow. But yeah, I'm going to end off the video right there. I want to thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, leave it a like. If you really, really liked it, leave it a favourite. Also, if you're new to the channel, make sure you hit the subscribe button down below. That'll make my day completely. And as always, I hope to see you in my very next video. I'll talk to you all later. Bye-bye. What? -bye.